Hey guys, today I wanted to give you a quick tour of the upcoming Bitesize 2.0 interface and features. Remember that this is currently in alpha and could change in the upcoming weeks. The new Bitesize is centered around apps. You can install apps one by one or follow the quick setup wizard. We'll be doing that now. The only detail that is required to get started is your IP. Plex needs this to allow you access to its web interface. Normally this is where you go and create a Plex account and connect your server to Plex, but since I already have an account, I don't have to do that and I'll add the server to my account later. I'm a big fan of friends, so let's add our Deluge details to the Think client and let's see if we can download the first season of friends, which I of course own on DVD. Next, while we're downloading, I will tie this Plex server to my Plex account. This will make sure I can always access the Plex web interface regardless of my IP and it makes it easier to see the server in the various Plex apps. Since I'm not a native speaker, I like it when Plex automatically selects subtitles for me by default. That's why I'm now setting up Plex to always select English subtitles if they are available. I'm making a small jump in the video here. Um, what you should know is that once the download is finished, your box does some magic behind the scenes. It will extract the content if it was compressed, it will look for available subtitles and download them, and it will create a link on the file system that uses a format that makes it easy for Plex to recognize which content you just downloaded. As you can see, Plex indexed the content. Let's try to play it. It seems to be working. Awesome. Remember that the real magic begins when you combine your new Plex server with one of the Plex apps. I use it to stream directly to my TV using a Chromecast, but there are also apps for Windows, OS X and iOS, Android, Samsung TVs, and even more. This is just a small subset of all the new features that got added. There is more to explore. I welcome you to go and try it out yourself. Until next time.